When I was starting out and doing my MJ, uh, you know, I was still a really green reporter. Definitely loved talking to so many people, learning so many things at my day job. In the evenings when I would do would go to school, it was really great to be in a classroom with teachers who were at the top of their craft, students who were really interested in learning, you know, just the same things that I did. It was really a great experience in order to learn what it means to be a journalist, but also a lot of the different skills required to be a journalist today. So I can't think of a more important time for there to be quality journalism out there globally. There is a lot of different data information that gets released that I think needs examination, needs a second look, and really needs interpretation to our readers, to the world, on what's going on. As an alumni of the program, I still feel very connected to the JMSC community, and I'm very proud to see the program continue to thrive and produce such engaging, dedicated, and curious reporters. The JMSC really strengthened my resolve to pursue a career in financial journalism. I really believe that financial journalists are at a prime place to really understand how the world works by following the money. Hong Kong is such an important place to be doing that sort of work because with all the money coming in out of China, which is rising to be the biggest economy, biggest story of our time, it's been a privilege to really have the front seat to all of that happening. Because the JMSC has such a strong career program, they put me in touch with quite a lot of editors in town that were looking for good, keen candidates. And one of the editors I met was at Bloomberg, who ended up introducing me to my future boss, um, who headed up the health and pharmaceuticals team at Bloomberg. Because of the way the JMSC program was structured, I felt that I walked into the job at Bloomberg with a lot of different skills that was needed to really hit the ground running. From writing feature stories to understanding what it takes to do a com comprehensive fact check, you know, I think all of those things were very thoughtful from the point of view of JMSC to give us all the skills as graduates to go into the workplace and be able to do the best job we can from day one. I always found myself thinking back on some of the principles I learned at the school. You know, seek the truth, leave no stone unturned. What a journalist should be doing is taking together so many different themes and ideas that you're observing and tying that together for a reader to understand and really to digest the world in a more clear and thoughtful way. And I really believe that the way I thought about things started at JMSC, in the classrooms, at Elliott Hall, and I'm really grateful to the school for that.